Hey everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer and today we'll be taking a look at our bulletproof hitches two ball adjustable ball mount with a maximum capacity of 36,000 pounds. So this is a two inch as well as a two and five sixteenths inch ball. So if you have different trailer couplers, you can adjust it as needed. Now you will have a different weight capacity depending on which one you use on the ball platform. So for the two inch, that's gonna be a 12,000 pound maximum towing capacity. And then for your two and five sixteenths, that's gonna be a maximum 36,000 capacity. So still very impressive. Now this is extreme duty. You have the black powder coat finish, matte black too, which will help resist corrosion, but your pins as well. If you've ever had to deal with rusted pins that you can't take off of the ball mount, well, you have a zinc top coat for these pins. That way, even with it out in the elements, they will help resist rust. Now, there are three positions for adjustment. So you can see how there's those different holes. You can have it at top one, bottom one. These holes are two inches apart. To take it apart, you can see how you can just take the clip out, take the pin out, and then you can easily adjust this up and down or even flip it around for using the different hitch ball. Now this includes two pin and clips for the ball platform fitting onto the ball mount. What it does not include though is the hitch pin for your shank to your hitch receiver. So you are going to need to pick one up separately. Make sure it matches your three inch hitch receiver. And you can even take a look at some of our options like the infinite rule locking pin set if you want to secure your ball mount. Now, since this is made of a solid steel, it's super heavy duty, but if you just want to flip it over and switch it from rise to drop, it's actually pretty easy to do. Now, there are two hitch pin holes here. That way you can have different adjustment for how far past your hitch receiver you want it to be. So we're gonna put it on the furthest hole, but each hole is about two inches apart, which gives you a little bit of option there. So you may want to use the other one depending on where your bumper or your fascia sits. We have this on a motorhome, you can have this on a truck as well, as long as you have that three inch hitch receiver. So we measure from the center of that hitch pin hole on that receiver to the closest point, which is this fin, that's gonna be six inches away. The length this entire ball mount adds to the back of our hitch is gonna be about 15 and a half inches. It gives you about four inches rise or drop, but for more specific measurements, we measure from the top inside edge of your hitch receiver right here. So the maximum rise is gonna be four and a quarter inches. The maximum drop or the droppiest drop is gonna be five and a quarter inches. So if you wanna compare this with maybe some other brand options, a uh, close one is the Kurt adjustable two ball mount. So very similar design, it has two balls, it can adjust up and down. The main difference is gonna be the capacity. This has a maximum capacity of 36,000 pounds, while the Kurt's maximum capacity is in a 20,000 pound range. So definitely a difference there. If you do like this style, you can get this exact same ball mount with a different rise and drop. But check out our product pages and our pictures and our videos if you want more information so that you can get the right ball mount for you. But this right here right now is a quick look at our Bulletproof Hitches two ball adjustable ball mount right here at eTrailer.com.